So I figured an area where these are laying eggs and they're laying eggs in a municipal compost pile that got destroyed last year and destroyed when they dry out. So let me show you where this little guy comes from. So this is a, a log I've been watering. And he's going back. See where he is? So, okay. So I had found this clutch of racer eggs and I wanted to keep them alive and not let them dry out. So I kind of have been watering this area and evidently it's nice and hot and they've hatched so yeah that's, all right yeah i've already missed all right i missed it oh oh all right there's there's some racers in there All right, so I've been kind of watering this and this is a, a greenhouse. Yeah, oh, oh, there's another one. Wow. Okay, there's still at least one in here. So all I did is I just relocated this clutch of eggs to a, a safe area that doesn't dry out and doesn't get destroyed. Because uh, where these guys are at, it's a big compost pile that gets moved around with bulldozers where the racers seem to like to lay their eggs. And last year, there was a clutch of eggs here and uh, last year was really dry and, oh, look at that. And very stupidly, I didn't. Oh, this is killer. Look at that. I don't know how many babies there are. That's a black racer. And what they like to do to get an idea of their settings. They like to do what Argus monitors do. And you know, it's essentially, it's a periscope. I mean, I can't speak. I'm too busy watching this, I'm sorry. I wasn't quite expecting this. So cute. This is what happens when we're not around. Life continues and little baby snakes hatch. But sometimes we intercede and try to prevent them from drying out. Look at that, it's going right up. Right up. It's so cool. Racer. I never get to see you little baby black racers ever. Look at that. Just showing you how insanely arboreal they are. Well, I guess my point is we can all do things to help animals. And my problem is life is constantly beating me and making me sad as we watch these animals vanish. So I try to just take a little bit of my energy and try to make a difference while I'm still here. This is this is really cool though. Come on, little baby black racer doing what it does. So if you're not paying attention, this is a little baby black racer. This is a nest that I've just been making sure is safe and has water and they evidently hatched at least i was lucky to see a couple of them 
I found an area where the snakes were, but I wanted to see more snakes. So what I did, I uh, transformed the area and I made it way more snaky. And it, it's taken a couple years to really hold the snakes, but this, it's really starting to hold the snakes. And trying to figure out where they're nesting is definitely a trick. The fact that these eggs made it is just awesome. Way up. Do you see me? Look at that. So cute. Baby black racer. Just totally arboreal. So it's hatching. You can see the little nose. That little guy. And uh, what's interesting about black racer eggs, if you touch the outside of the shell, they're pebbled. So they're very kind of like rough. And a lot of times that's a good way to note if actually the eggs you're finding are black racer eggs. And of course, these are a bit bigger than milk snake eggs and ringneck snakes. But about the same size as maybe a little bit smaller than a black rat. Just, I thought that egg was empty. And there's got a little baby in it. And there's another one right there. And then we got this one. Way up on some goldenrod. hatched water <laughs> help make this actually happen so let's see how many eggs there are one, two, I don't know 13, 14 eggs uh, oh there's an egg that even hasn't even hatched I think helping these has really made this successful. And uh, at the very least, it's really great to see because I never get to see this. I, f I found eggs last year, but they're all dried up. Same spot. So I made sure soak the wood and keep the whole thing humid. And I don't even see a single bad egg. I'll pip that egg and see what's in there. I gotta turn my camera on, dude. You didn't turn your camera on!